Images of disasters fill us with empathy and compassion. Whether we have a personal connection to the tragedy or not, we feel grief and sorrow for those involved. During times of disaster, we pray with all our hearts that God's love would be experienced by hurting families and individuals, and that those who are lost would find Christ. Our prayers are answered as our own brothers and sisters answer the call. Since 1967, Southern Baptists have responded to disasters around the globe. California Southern Baptist Convention Disaster Relief began in response to the Kalinga earthquake in 1983. Since then, CSBC disaster relief teams have responded to more than 80 catastrophic incidents. These include natural disasters such as hurricanes, earthquakes, floods, fires, mudslides, and tsunamis, as well as ice and wind storms. CSBC disaster relief teams also have responded to civil emergencies like the 1992 Rodney King riots in Los Angeles and the 2001 terrorist attack in New York City. Through partnerships with the American Red Cross, the Salvation Army, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, FEMA, and others, California Southern Baptists serve disaster victims and minister to their needs through a variety of services that include, but are not limited to, mass feeding, mud out of homes, fire cleanup, debris removal, chainsaw work, chaplaincy, communications, water purification, shower trailers, and emergency repairs. In the recent Northern and Southern California wildfires and during Hurricane Ike, CSBC Disaster Relief prepared more than 700,000 meals, cleared more than 325 home sites, and saw 18 people come to know Christ as personal Savior. The purpose of Disaster Relief Ministries is to provide help to victims so it's possible for them to look to the future with hope. Disaster relief volunteers are motivated by the second chapter of James, in which we are admonished to prove our faith through our actions. Disaster relief ministries strive to meet both physical and spiritual needs in times of catastrophe. So what can you do to support this ministry? Pray. Disaster relief teams often are called to areas made dangerous by the disaster itself. Pray for safety and soften hearts of both victims and volunteers. Another way individuals can support disaster relief is through giving. God has blessed Southern Baptist with time, talent, and possessions, all of which can be used in His service to others. Churches can also support disaster relief ministries by adopting a disaster relief unit to see that the unit's financial obligations are taken care of during the year. If a church is unable to adopt a unit on its own, a group of churches may partner in the cost of adoption. Regardless of the form it takes, congregations are encouraged to include CSBC Disaster Relief Ministries as part of their regular giving. Disaster Relief is always looking for volunteers. If you feel called to this ministry, various training opportunities are available throughout the year. The ministry changes and blesses the lives of both disaster victims and volunteers. Disaster relief is one of the many opportunities for God to use you in His kingdom's work. Disaster relief is an investment in your life and in the lives of others. Won't you become involved today to make a difference in the world by demonstrating His love with action?